Hey guys, what's up? Valence Ring here, and I'm doing a video on Nuka Land. I don't know if I'll uh, use this yet, but I'm going to try. Just want to give some tips and tricks that uh, I found from my experience from the first time, and we'll see if they work. Um, so I'm just going to give it a try. Uh, I might cut the video up, um, so it might be edited pretty heavily, um, depending on uh, how things are going. Um, and obviously, I don't want to spend an hour in one video. But um, I'm going to go ahead and, and shoot the video, and we'll see how it goes. So... Just buy a military boost just in case. So, not too worried about it. Uh, biggest, my biggest tip right now is don't fight over resource spots. There's plenty of them. Uh, only put out three, maybe four marches. You really, really want to focus on some other stuff, like this guy here. But um, honestly, I wouldn't even fight over that stuff. Just gather as much as you can. Maxing out your gather will give you a point. Um, if someone's attacking you, then maybe worry about it. Make sure you know who's around you. But I have pretty much higher might than most of, most of these. Uh, so I'm not too worried about it. I just want to maximize my gathering. If people do attack me, then I'll worry about that later. But uh, for the most part, I'm not too worried about it just yet. Most of these guys are under my might level. So we'll see how it plays out. As you'll notice here, this guy's level 30, even though it's only supposed to go up to level 29. So one of the tricks that people are doing for Nuka is right before Nuka, if they're going to go ahead and upgrade their headquarters, they'll sign up, wait until after the sign-up period, and then boost their headquarters and shoot for some of those higher level troops. Uh, only works obviously going from 29 to 30, I think is the biggest boost because of the tier um, 10 troops that you get at uh, headquarters level 30. It's kind of a cheap trick, but hey, I'll probably end up trying to do the exact same thing. Uh, you might as well maximize your points so as you notice I have two marches I'm saving and those I'll try and uh, speed up and get the bombs and the shields uh, preferably the shields because if I can get enough shields uh, and bombs then what I'll be able to do is take over some of those resource spots that you have to occupy for three minutes um, the boxes basically and that's what I'm waiting on so I do want to gather um, a couple marches but I want to wait for those shields um, and uh, the bombs which are down here um, but we have to wait for them to spawn in and I think they spawn in the the wasteland area here 
So definitely be watching for that. See, these guys are duking it out for this, and that's cool. I get it. I mean, you're getting 26,000 per hour, but uh, you're just wasting a lot of troops and, and, and heal ups. Um, obviously, with the state infirmary, you don't have to worry about uh, using resources for heals. Uh, it's just speed ups, but I really hate wasting a ton of speed ups. I don't have any heal speed ups right now, so I really don't want to do that. Um, I want to save all my speed ups for other stuff. I just want to get the max points. I think it's 100,000 points. Um, so that's what I'm shooting for. I'm not going to worry about too much else. these guys are going for I must have missed it It's almost maxed. Uh, hopefully more spots spawn close to me. Like I said, only want about two or three out. Uh, I don't want to waste too much uh, resources gathering. But one trick is because uh, I only have three marches out. Once uh, I get close to capping one out, I'll go ahead and send another march when I know I have one coming back. I want to make sure I have plenty of troops in my sanctuary. Put on anti-scout so they can't see what I'm doing. And then hopefully all of that will benefit me in the long run. Some of these guys are pretty tough. And a lot of them are pretty similar might to me. So I don't think they'll mess with me too much. But uh, could definitely get a little hairy. So about 69% on all three of mine. Got to hope for the best. And one trick uh, I would recommend is also if you, you know, we're going to send out a farther march, uh, send that one first. And then your closer marches, uh, kind of, you want similar times on them uh, to try to maximize it. Anyways, so uh, most of it's going to be pretty boring. I'm uh, sitting around looking at stuff. Um, I'm waiting on those shields to pop or the um, bonuses to pop. Definitely want to keep an eye out for that. And make sure you're focused on that. It'd be a stressful hour. Eighty seven percent. So I only have three marches out. So it should be about one minute. Uh, I think every ten minutes is kind of like when things change. So start looking for those uh, shields and bombs to pop up. So I'm hoping something hits right in this area so I can have a quick march to it. Uh, 30 seconds and I expect that to happen. I have 
two marches. Hopefully I'll be able to grab both of them. So 10 seconds. Keep your eyes peeled. It takes about 10 minutes to gather from a, a four. Oh, I kind of messed that up, but that's okay. Yep. I'm actually gonna... I'm gonna let that one happen, I think. So hopefully they'll let me gather there. <laughs> it might not, obviously. Gather. Let's send out a bunch of T1. We'll see. If I can get one or two of those boxes, that'd be great. Just I, I just want to occupy spots. I don't want to fight anybody over this stuff. If I can keep my boxes, that'll be great. About four marches out. I will always want to save one. Obviously, I got most of my troops in. And that's probably going to hurt. So... see what their might is 118 but that one's been hit so what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna pull that back no reason to take the loss you can have that one if you let me have my other one one on one I think that's fair no reason to waste it Again, don't want to waste troops if you don't have to. No reason to fight over it. See, these guys want to fight over it. It's just kind of a waste. I mean, obviously, you know, especially later on in the bigger boxes, you want to fight over it. I totally get that. This guy attacks my box. I might zero his freaking headquarters. He's not. He shouldn't even try. I'm not gonna be able to do well. one box that's good wasn't expecting that honestly so much fighting over the boxes and I, maybe it's my might helps like I'm not gonna fight them over that box it's just not worth it I'd rather you know I'd rather have my tier one troops gathering and you know these boxes pop up go for them so about halfway through this round maybe some more boxes will spawn Hopefully in my area. Again, I'm not fighting over it. No sense in wasting the troops. So I will use some of my heal ups. Oh, there you go. Got all my troops back. Good enough. Lost that box, but one one, so that's good. Just max gathering. Get the boxes when you can. Don't fight over it too much. <clears throat> you know, the higher level boxes might be worth it to fight over. Well, a lot of these lower one, might ones, not so much. So now I have four marches out. It's a little bit risky. 
I'd rather stick with three, but I also want to make sure I'm gathering as max as possible. I'm not even going to worry about a lot of this stuff, and hopefully some more boxes spawn and I can grab one. So probably in the next five minutes, uh, five more minutes. Ooh, that I want. That's a shield, so. Oh, see, that's why I wanted that second march out. Come on, hurry back. Oh, I gotta make sure my military. Okay, good. Yeah, dang, that grenade is great. Oh, I wish I wouldn't have missed that. That's the benefit of keeping two marches out. Uh, it doesn't require anything. You can send one troop to grab that, I believe. Yeah, it's all right. I was able to get one uh, shield. It looks like it helps. Uh, okay, so that negates blast great grenade damage, which is good because blast grenade basically kills all your troops. So if someone has a blast grenade and uh, they hit your tile, it doesn't work in sanctuaries, but if they hit your tile, uh, it kills all your troops. So you, you can't win that battle. So at least I have a shield um, that'll protect from that. And then uh, we'll go from there. I'd like to have as many shields as possible. A couple grenades would be nice. Should have saved that second troop. And I'll, I'll remember to do that next time. So. But at least I have a shield in case someone does attack me. About three and a half minutes and we should get some more stuff popping up here. Definitely want to keep our eyes out. Or maybe when this last box gets taken over. Uh, still new to this. So we'll see what happens. So I'm not too worried about my sanctuary. I have plenty of troops uh, in there, at least 600,000. Let's see, about two and a half minutes and there should be more boxes popping up. Maybe when this one finishes, So I'm not too worried about ranking, I know it matters, but I'm more worried about uh, maximizing my points, and uh, you can check that here, the event reward, so I just want to get down to that uh, 100,000 mark. 17%, about 20 minutes in, so it's going to be cutting it close, but the boxes tear up, so some of the boxes will be getting better. I definitely need a grenade and probably another shield or two. Need some marches to come back. So just gotta make sure when your marches do come back that you're resending them out. Hopefully you can find some empty RSS spots. There are plenty of spots, which is another reason you really shouldn't fight over them. Why waste troops on, you know, 13,000, I think it is. Not even, it's 2,000. You're fighting over 2,000 points. You know, when a box is worth 20,000, that's a level 1 box, I believe, is worth 20,000 points. So those are way more beneficial. You know, I'm like, this is a, a tougher heavy might player. Hopefully they're going to, you know, stay focused on this and I can focus on other stuff and they won't worry about me too much. Got to kind of pick and choose your battles, who you're going to fight. So obviously keep an eye on what's going on. See, I only have one minute left, so technically I should start gathering from this, but I really, really don't want to do that because I know in 40 seconds they're going to drop more boxes. So as, soon, as long as they drop a box in my area, I'll send a full march out, um, hopefully my strongest march, and uh, that'll do well, hopefully. Alright, so 20 seconds... 
be watching. Let's go. Hopefully Athena has most of her marches out. Try and take over that box there. My strongest lineup. And I should have my some of my marches coming back here any second. And again, I just want to focus on one box. I don't want to spend a lot of resources, you know, fighting these guys over this stuff. This guy might might try it. I'm lagging. He might be able to take it, but uh, we'll see. So, four marches. Oh, shit. I'm just going to return. I accidentally sent too many troops. Don't want to duke it out for that. Again, save my battle, save my troops for um, other attacks. You know, I can gather from here with some vagrants. Not a big deal. Don't duke it out over resource spots. It's not worth it. Anybody who thinks that it is, they're just wasting resources. Then, like this person here, are you scouting me or attacking? Really far away. Ooh. Okay. Got some might to them. See what happens. Got about a 60 million might march. It's a pretty tough march. Uh, so most people aren't going to just sit there and, you know, especially because I'm just going to send a, a march right back at them. And realistically, that's what you want to do. Find, if you find a box that's not too heavily contested, like, you know, they got three people fighting over this box, I'm not sure that makes any sense. But, I mean, I get it. Uh, you get 15,000 nuke ore from a level 2. You got to occupy the box for 3 minutes. It's actually kind of difficult if people are on super attack mode. Which, I mean, if they're continuously attacking this, I don't know if I want to get involved in battles too much. So, I mean, I could take that guy and take this guy. So, I might go for that box. We'll see. They're duking it out anyways. All right. So I definitely don't want to mess with Athena or Grizz. But I will probably Axel 77, who is that? Maybe somebody now I don't know even know if I wanna fight for that box. Probably should, but you know, there again, I'd rather just grab a box and have people ignore me. No reason to fight over it. There's lots of boxes. I'll have plenty of opportunities to get rewards. Make sure I'm gathering. Getting kind of full over here. That's okay. I'm not going to fight over a resource spot. If all my marches come back and I can't find anything, you got to remember every time, you know, these these fill up uh, or get, you know, withdrawn from, it's going to spawn more. So, you know, it, even if you have to wait a minute, it's probably better to do that than uh, duke it out for 2,000 points. And, you know, desperate for points maybe it'd be different, but... Oh, see, and they reset the time. Oof. Yeah, it's pretty strong. Ooh, fighter shooter based. I'm going to let them go. I don't want to deal with that. So, I got a bunch of marches. I need to find resource spots, and I need to find... Um, bombs. No, I don't want to waste 
nice diamonds on it. If I get it, I get it. Hopefully I get it. People aren't paying attention, that really helps. Get that grenade. Beautiful. So now I have a grenade. That'll help in defense of my next box. I got a grenade and a shield. So, like I said, pick your battles. And you definitely want those grenades and shields if at all possible. And the boxes spawn every 10 minutes, so about halfway through, it looks like you get the shield, shields and grenades. So see, we got kind of uh, three big dogs over here, and basically, we're not fighting each other, and we're able to get a lot of these boxes and stuff. Uh, without too many casualties and without too much effort um, and that's kind of good you got to kind of like I said pick your battles um, you know if some small smaller might person's just really trying to beat you up for no good reason um, you know then that's when you kind of want to maybe focus on attacking but for the most part you know you got four or five people attacking this one resource I'll, I'd rather see them duke it out and lose resources than me it's not worth it to me 15,000 points I get closer to the end and I'm, I don't have enough points then I'll, I'll consider you know wasting all my troops on it but right now it's not worth it I don't think I have any gatherers out it's gonna be problematic definitely got to find some gathering spots I'm wasting time here not paying attention so let's send some out if I can find the spot, even if it's not close. Yeah, see this guy's on fire. Such a waste, realistically. Where is that coming from? Yeah, got some might to him. Some people do like to burn sanctuaries. That's another reason I like to keep as many of my troops in base as possible, especially my higher tier troops. Definitely don't want to waste time on, on those guys. Send that out. Again, if someone's going to attack my tier one troops, they can have them. Uh, you know, heal them up in infirmary, or I'll recall instead of wasting it. Especially from a gathering spot. Just keep an eye out for blast grenades and shields and box should pop in another minute and a half I think so definitely want to be on the lookout for that a lot of swiping you can hit this button over here and get more uh, screen real estate it definitely helps when searching especially when it's really busy like this but I like to see how many marches I have out and be able to quick select up here and, and recall that's why I usually leave that up. But so I got three marches out, that's good. Ooh, they're duking it out over this box. Yeah, you can have it. That's what he said. Out. Again, don't duke it out over resource spots. If you're duking it out for resource spots, I don't, I don't know why. There's plenty of them, even if you have to go a little further. Look, here's one that's wide open. You know, you're going to be fine gathering. Don't waste it. Get those blast grenades and shields. Use those for attacking, you know, these boxes if you need to. But smart thing. Get your, your bombs and your shields and save them for the high level boxes, the boxes that actually matter. Got 40 seconds left. I'm going to go ahead and gather. It might be a little risky. Yeah, I'll probably end up recalling this because there's no reason to. I might actually let them die. I'll take a second. I 
I might lose that resource spot. Oh, okay. I got time. I'm not too worried about it. So I got three out. Oof. That's Axel. Athena. Alright. So, see? I'm worried about all the wrong things, but shouldn't have been worried about that stuff. It's a level 3 box. Don't like attacking boxes because you have limited troops after that, but I'm going to go ahead and send one out. Hopefully he recalls. I think I lost that resource spot. That's okay. Or that two minute heal. You can have it. Hopefully I can get that box. No casualties. I won't duke it out with these tough guys, but see what happens. Alright. I lost 22,000 troops. And I will probably recall if that guy tries to hit that box. No reason wasting uh, speed ups. I need another gather troop out. Gotta find an empty spot. That looks empty. Send out some vagrants. Hopefully I get lucky and hold this. Uh, I don't think that I will. Looks like he said I'm mostly fighters and shooters. Now you can tell what's in the march just by looking at it. But I don't know if I'll be able to hold it. We'll see. So I was able to hold it. Unfortunately, a second march is going to take it over. So go ahead and speed this up. Go ahead and do that. Select, select all, select all. 19 hours heal, so I've got pretty much nothing left in that. So anybody that's going to attack this is going to win it, so I need to recall if that's the case. Fighter attack too. I'm surprised I won that. Uh, unfortunately, I'm going to lose this box. hate wasting resources. I've been buying a lot of uh, one hour speed ups for this and other events. I don't, I don't think I'm going to make it. No reason wasting speed ups. Oh, guys duking it out over these threes, man. That's part of the game. But I don't think I had enough troops in there, so...
rider based. Wait, this such a waste. Let's see where I'm at in points. All right, almost to sixty thousand, hundred thousand. Uh, don't have much time left. I definitely need probably a level four box. Might as well send out a scout. See what they got. Well, I can probably take that, but there again, do I want to waste it? KOA, I know that. KOA ashes. problem with hitting this is that it's going to wipe most of my out most of my stuff out I'll win the battle but don't know that that'll help me much all right still got three marches out I need another grenade is what I need Grenades win the battle. So definitely be looking for those. Starting to get down to the nitty gritty here. Which is in those level threes, twenty thousand at level three. I definitely want the twenty thousand points, but yeah. See, these guys are still duking it out. Why is my screen doing that? I can't attack it. That's weird. Almost like someone's got a hack on it. Interesting. Might not be impossible. Yeah, it's only fifteen hundred, but beats a blank. All right, so four marches out. All right, so 20 seconds here. Level four boxes should pop up. So these guys are still duking it out over threes. Level four should pop up any second, and that's what we want. All right, five seconds. Oh my god. So what we're going to do. Oh, I know it's coinciding. You know, let that happen. Whatever happens, happens. Alright, so I do know it takes me 40 seconds to get there. It's an important distinction.
Man, my game's lagging so bad. Is anybody even in this one yet? Okay. get hit by someone else and resend I definitely need a four I don't want to fight that guy for it I'll go ahead and send a scout I need a grenade not much time left strong but that's kind of a point it's gonna do some damage so let's attack put my shooters out there again <clears throat> four marches I need to gather on this one 29 seconds left so I will gather that don't like losing my marches unattended but I don't like having full marches out. You just open yourself up a little bit for disaster, but that's okay. Should take that. We shall see. So many. So many. that too much. I will probably let them hit that and hope for a win. Just gotta hope for a win. Check my battle log. That's what I need to do. So, 75,000. Probably going to lose to most stuff. Come on, Axel. Let me have that. My blast grenade should should prevent the next attack. But we'll see. Ah, oh, such a waste. All right, guys. I'm gonna start getting angry. I'm just gonna use a 24 hour. Select all. Speed up. Okay. Oh, 
I'm starting to get mad. Zero this guy so bad. Oof. Level four boxes are getting scarce. my points at is a question. I'm not gathering as much as I need to. Slacking. I need a gathering spot. Come back over here. What us? Pretty sure they're gonna win. Let's just recall. We got fives coming up in one minute. Let's save our resources for that. Okay, so last 10 minutes, and I need points. Oh, I need 100, I need 50,000. I need this box. Definitely need a higher level box. Something, I need something. I'm not gonna make it with what I got. Should have just left them. Wasn't good.
All right, so as you can see, I ended up uh, ranked 22nd. Uh, I did not finish 100,000 points. I did, wasn't able to get one of those higher level boxes, which I wish I could have, but that's okay. It's how it goes. Um, I'm still learning it, and I'll see what I can do. I will get uh, four of the Hero uh, Choice Card 4, which are great. So happy about that. At least I did rank. Uh, last time I didn't rank, I did so bad. But uh, learning as I go, and hopefully uh, the video helped you guys out. And good luck in Nuka Land. Uh, it's not my favorite event, but if you play it smart, uh, hopefully it's not too bad for you. And hopefully you can get that 100,000 points. All right, guys, thanks a lot. Uh, if you like the video, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more content like this. Thank you.